Datuk Sri Anwar Ibrahim is confident in continuing the reform agenda he has been advocating since taking over the administration of Putrajaya in November 2022, even though the unity government he leads is formed by a coalition of several different political parties. Furthermore, the Prime Minister said strong consensus among the parties comprising the unity government also allowed for more reform agendas to be implemented by the government. He said this included combating corruption, good governance as well as reform agendas in education. Anwar said praise should be given to the parties that he lead and also the coalition parties including from Sabah and Sarawak. He wants to say that for a year and a half, he has been leading the government. Not a single one of them who are colleagues from the coalition parties came to him and said, Anwar, go slow on fighting corruption or we don't support this reform. None of them. He added that's why he can do it with full enthusiasm and confidence and he believes Malaysia can continue this reform. Anwar said this during a Q&A session after delivering a public lecture in front of about 300 attendees at the Qatar National Library at Hamad bin Khalifa University in Doha, May 13. The Prime Minister is currently on a three-day visit to Qatar, the second Gulf Arab country visited after Saudi Arabia in a mission to attract new investments, especially from West Asian countries.